Now to the proposal to create a marijuana grow operation in Seekonk inside the old Showcase Cinemas building. And tonight, the current owner of the former movie theater met with residents to talk about the idea. I would assume reporter Steph Machado is here now with the new details. After hearing concerns from Seekonk residents tonight, the owner of the old Showcase Cinemas says he's willing to only propose a marijuana grow operation there and hold off on retail sales. We are homeowners. People who live in Seekonk sounding off at an informational meeting about a proposed marijuana cultivation facility at the long empty Showcase Cinemas on Route 114A. The idea of it having it right there next to so many residential places, residential homes, I mean, there's hundreds of people that live there, and I, I wouldn't want it next to me. Town select woman Michelle Hines questioning why the developers can't build their cultivation facility in the industrial area of Seekonk that's already zoned for marijuana. The town voted for that. It was made by the planner. I don't think we would be having all this if it was there. Because we want to bury everything. Why are we burying everything? Charlie Tapalian is the man who bought the Showcase Cinemas a few months ago. He also owns the surrounding Greenbrier apartments. He brought in businessman Jamie Crum, who wants to grow marijuana inside the old theater and then sell it at retail locations in the Boston area. The original plan was to sell it at the Showcase, too. But after neighbors expressed concerns Wednesday night about traffic and proximity to schools, Tapalian said he's willing to ditch the retail idea. But I would have no problem in changing our concept to just growing at the showcase and shipping it to Boston or shipping it to wherever. And Tapalian would need Seekonk voters to approve a zoning change in order to turn the old showcase into a marijuana facility. He has not yet submitted an application for that. He is separately also asking voters for a zoning change to build 100 townhouses behind the showcase. There is a meeting on Monday about that, just the condos, not the marijuana proposal. I'm Steph Machado, Eyewitness News.